This is a plain CD scan of a 68 years old male patient. The patient is a known hypertensive and diabetic. Now please observe these hypodense lanes in the lower part of right cerebellum. These are infarcts. Now as I scroll up, extra cerebral CSF spaces are mildly dilated, suggestive of mild cerebral atrophy. Both the lateral ventricles are dilated with the rounding of frontal horns. Third ventricle is also dilated. Ill-defined areas of reduced attenuation are noted in bilateral periventricular bite matter. This is suggestive of subcortical arteriosclerotic encephalopathy. Now please observe that as I scroll it up, the brain parenchyma is pushed upwards and it abuts against the inner surface of the upper parts of the parietal bone. Now, the extra cerebral CSF species dilatation here, this is disproportionately more as compared to the upper part of the parietal lobes where it, where the brain parenchyma or the upper parts of parietal lobes, they are effaced against the inner surface of the parietal bone. Now, I will show you the angle here. This one is measures approximately 72 degrees. So, it, it's a case of normal pressure hydrocephalus.